Hi all, I want to talk with you about how to stop all pains, guaranteed, tried and tested. So, if eating a healthy diet or... So, yeah, if eating a healthy diet or eating organic foods only mainly aim towards mainly aim try and aim towards eating organic food as much as possible and cutting down the sweets and chocolates and don't don't try and drink filtered water and not not necessarily bottled water and don't drink tap water and you've tried praying praying going to church and praying and if all of those things don't work then and don't and and don't eat any chemical food and if all of those things don't work then all i can say is just keep persevering eventually your body will iron itself out and the pain will go in 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 the whole of your body because when we eat chemical foods junk food the, the the pizza hut the mac the mac macadies or and the and the juicy juicy thigh chicken and the juicy kfc all of these chemical foods will will eventually damage our body in some way whether in whether it's in pain or any kind of way because some some foods mo most chemical foods can cause cancer as well believe it or not and it's always good to eat. Apparently, it's good to eat cranberry to to stop cancer at, on at, on its track, at its dead on dead dead in its tracks. As cranberries, the more organic, the better. And I've heard of Granny Granny Smiths are good as well. They they I think they're cooking apples. And and always always do go for organic foods as much as possible. Try and make your whole food be organic. And it's it's always good to eat. It's always good to eat the the, the bone marrow of a chicken. Just try and eat the whole, chew the whole bone and take out and eat and swallow the whole juice and the and the and the bone marrow and then spit out the, the excess the excess part that can't be di that can't be liquidized in your mouth when you're chewing so it should be like so it should be like like so so when you finish chewing it the bone the bone and finish chewing the bone marrow it will it should look like 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 wheat like light brown because apparently the bone marrow in, in in the chicken bone is good for the is good for the bone, and uh, apparently the cartilage, the little rub, rubbery part, is good for the, the the cartilage. The cartilage, the rub, rubbery part, is good for the for the joints. It's also chicken is also good for cold for cold and flu, for 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 quick healing and quick repair in the body. So, but like I, but you know, as as some 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 of us might have noticed in the news, <clears throat> some 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 people are trying to commit suicide by by letting the doctor by getting assisted suicide. But you know, if we're in pain all the time, non-stop, twenty-four-seven, it's not. It's not. It's not really, it's not really God's will for us to commit suicide because it's not the calling of God. Because we're never, we're never really born to 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 to, to eventually take our own lives. I know it, I know it might be human rights, but we we have to think about other people because when we try to commit suicide or do do assisted suicide, we're putting we're putting other lives at danger and the vulnerable the vulnerable at danger of committing suicide when they when they don't need to commit suicide when it's something they're doing wrong not eating healthily or something like that because when somebody 
especially especially the people that are, the people that are mentally ill because because they're in so much stress and, and worry and, and, and mental problems they'll think that ending their life is is the best option when somebody when somebody when somebody when 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 they when they when they're not well they'll think ending their life is 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 is, be, is the best thing so when when so when somebody normal that's not on medication for mental illness thinks thinks it's a great idea to have an assisted suicide bill to come to pass and and to actually happen eventually somebody with mental illness is going to think it's a good idea it's a good idea to commit suicide because because they because they, they're stressed because they they're worried and, and they're bothered about their thoughts and stuff and they think the best things to do is to, is to not be around anymore and just commit suicide so it's not a wise, it's not a wise idea to 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 have an assist to have an assisted suicide just because we're in pain we have to think about other people as well so that's really all I have to say in this video so let me pray before we go heavenly father thank you for your grace and mercy be upon us father pray grace and mercy be upon us from past present and future pray heal us right now father in jesus name heal us right now father in jesus name in your own precious time father for those that are who are in pain oh god or oh, whilst i'm whilst we're praying oh god pray reveal to them the answer to their prayers oh god because prayer is not just about healing Prayer is also about a revelation of understanding of, of, of a new knowledge or, or, or a new idea or new wisdom. Prayer, prayer reveals the, the reveals and opens up the clutches of, of what the enemy is trying to hide from, from humanity, from human beings. So help us to Father as we pray. Help us to solve the problem that we're going through with, with, with being in pain, O oh God. And we pray, O oh God, for this assisted suicide bill to never, go, never come to pass because... because because it will be preying on the vulnerable, the, the vulnerable that are mentally ill and, and the ones that are really suffering, the, the ones that are suffering that don't really want to commit suicide. But it could easily be through peer peer pressure that people want to commit, that people want to commit suicide. And because because the law the law the law says we can commit suicide, it will, it will greatly encourage the, the the most vulnerable to commit suicide, which will which will in fact will which will not be beneficial to. To their parents and families, because because we can't we, when we do things, oh God, we can't always just think about ourselves. We got to think about humanity and, and the human race at large, the, uh, and and globally, oh, oh God. We we pray, Heavenly Father, even though it's in other countries, you know, so, some countries are more vulnerable than more vulnerable than others, and we pray, oh God, that this 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 bill does, never comes to. We pray, O oh God, that this bill will never come 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 to pass. We pray, Heavenly Father, that, but by grace and mercy, Father, if this bill comes to pass, we pray, Heavenly Father, that that, that the vulnerable will be not will be not will not be attacked, and not not be pressurized, O oh God. We pray, Heavenly Father, for this bill never to come to pass. In Jesus' name, Father, we pray, your grace and mercy be upon that situation, Father. Let Your will be done in our lives, O oh God. Pray grace and mercy be upon us. Pray heal us right now, Father, from physical pain, from traumatic pain, O oh God. We pray for healing and rest, healing and restoration in our bodies, Father. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ in, in our situation. Right now, Father, heal us right now by your grace and mercy, Father. And in your own precious time, O oh God, we, pray, we plead the blood of Jesus Christ in our situation. Give us wisdom in what to do, O oh God, in, all, in, what, in what to do in looking after ourselves, Father. Give us wisdom, O oh God, to be able to, to be able to counteract the pain that we we're, we're going through right now, Father. In Jesus' name, we 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 we, we thank you, Lord, for your for your for the past, present, and future. We thank you, Father. We we able to gather here in your presence to be able to pray, to pray and cry out freely, pray and cry out, Father. Because for, for in some religions, O oh God, in in some not in some religions, but in some countries, O oh God, Christians are not allowed to pray. We're not allowed to pray out loud and, and publicly, O oh God. We thank you, Father, that we're in a we thank you, O oh God, that we're in a country that we're able to freely pray, freely do what whatever we like, Father, within reason, as long as we're not killing anyone, Father. 
but we 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 pray heavenly father that you 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 pour out your spirit upon us father by our grace and mercy in christ jesus we plead with jesus christ in the and pour out your spirit oh god upon us oh god Help us to be free in our bodies and our minds, O oh God. In the blood of Jesus, I plead the blood of Jesus in our situation. We pray these things all. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you guys, gals. Bye for now.